Five, two, two markers in the position vector r meters of a particle at t seconds is given by r is 1 at 12t minus 2t squared i and um, t squared minus 6tj. Part 1 answers to find an expression for the velocity of the particle at time t. Okay, so velocity, even when we're in vectors, is the derivative of displacement with respect to t. So that's going to give us, well, 1 add 12t minus 2t squared differentiates to 12 minus 4t. So we got 12 minus 4t i add uh, 2t minus 6j. So that is the velocity vector. Okay, then part two wants us to determine whether the particle is ever stationary. So, if the particle is stationary then, so stationary means that velocity would equal zero in terms of the vector we would need v to be zero i and zero k so let's solve each component equal to zero and see if we get a common solution if there isn't a common solution then it would always at least be moving horizontally or vertically or both but if there is a common solution then at that time there would be no horizontal movement and no vertical movement so 12 minus 40 being equal to zero comes as t is equal to three. Two uh, t minus six equals zero. Also gives us t is three. So when t is 3, velocity is 0, i add 0, j, which means the particle is stationary at t equals 3, cool.